Hello everyone, Mrs. Zassi, and don't I have amazing fight for you, amazing fight. Well, Oscar Rivas, the first Bridgeway champion, uh, whatever or whoever is that, well, he's not defending his title, he's moving up back to super heavyweight where he was fighting against guys of Dylan White, right? that was a great fight, I would say very good fight. He's moving back to take on another big challenger uh, in terms of body stature, yeah, a tall guy, a big boy. So yeah guys, interesting fight, I would say amazing fight, as Oscar Rivas a short guy, he always fights tall opponents and there's, for him there is no choice of just going in there and look for that big KO, because he not gonna outbox his opponents. But now F.A. Jagba is a tall guy, six foot six, very masculine, um, power punch. You could say he's power puncher. Uh, he cannot really box. He's boxing. He's lacking in the boxing department because even though he has a strong jab, he cannot move around. He can't really move around. He's lacking on the footwork. He's lacking on his jab. Um, yeah, so his style is just power punching, looking for those big KOs. And it's fine, it's absolutely fine. But now we have two guys, they both have aggressive styles. So no one is playing the B side. They're both there to get the knockouts. Both of them have uh, a stamina issues, like on later rounds. So they're both pushing everything out in first rounds. Uh, Oscar Rivas, he has no choice but go and fight and look for the KO. And if uh, Jagba, it could be an easy fight for him because he's 6'6". Six, six. Uh, just to move around, use his jab, but problems there, first of all, he cannot really stay behind the jab, and second of all, he cannot move backwards, he does not have the footwork or the skill to do that, he cannot run around the ring. So, it's two guys, short versus tall, both are going to be meeting in the middle of the ring, and just giving it, it all, and looking for the knockout. That's it. <laughs> this will gonna be amazing slugfest. This will gonna be like a classical fight that everyone wants to see. I really hope it's not gonna get cancelled. Um, yeah. And in comment section, when I was reading about this fight, there's already lots of comments, guys. People are excited. Uh, I think this is kind of a Jack Bass comeback fight, and he's looking for someone who has a good record, who's a tough opponent, but at the same time, he can compensate for the height. And have as much as advantage fighting someone. That's why he's fighting Rivas. Uh, and Rivas again, maybe he won the WBC belt in Bridgeway Division. Means absolutely nothing. It is the most useless belt out there. Because he hasn't defended. And it's been a one year since it happened. So yeah guys. So that's how the experiment in Bridgeway Division is going. I think this is going to be a slugfest. Up to the middle rounds of the fight, I think someone will gonna go to the sleep. I actually favoring Rivas to win this one. Yes, I'm betting on Rivas. I just think he's a bit better. Even there is a large high difference, I think Rivas is better. And he can be able to withstand Jagba's attacks. Uh, because that's what Rivas is doing. He has the same game plan for every single fight. He's short versus tall. And it's quite difficult to fight a shorter guy who's actually good at his craft. And I would say Oscar Rivas is quite good at his craft. So guys, we're going to see it on 14th of January. I think this is going to be an amazing fight. Um, what can I say? Uh, this is a comeback fight for FA Jagba to get him back on the track or uh, in a big boxing. If he can pull off a victory, and he could, he could. But in this case, I would heavily favor Oscar Rivas to win. Besides, like, one big punch for F.A. Jagba. Um, yeah, I mean, like, Jagba can't really box, and Rivas is leaning, ducking, slipping. That's, that's what he's doing. So I think he's going to have a clear advantage in this fight, even though he's short a guy. And, yeah, guys, I mean, leave your comments below. Uh, who you think who's going to win? Because this is an amazing fight. This is an amazing matchup. Uh, and yeah, guys, I'm favoring Oscar Rivas by knockout, <laughs> and I think this is going to be overall a great slugfest. So, guys, leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe, and Mrs. Us out.